What is this? What is this? Rethinking education, economics, and spirituality. One stop shopping with yogi, mystic, and visionary. Although it's blurry, this. When we. What is this? What is this? What is this? Fishbowl? What is it? What is this? Some sort of mind mash cloud? Refer to human beings today. Oh, of course. Can't we wait. don't refer to them as humans. We refer to them as Indians, Americans, Emiratis and whatever else and whatever else. So split, 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 mash, mash. Let's begin. Nothing wrong with this on one level. There's nothing wrong with the swarm. Because a nation is the largest segment of humanity that you can address in terms of bringing well-being. Bringing you well-being, whoa! A nation is what brings you well-being? Wow, wow! It isn't the people that live around you and actually bring you well-being, no. But it's the largest extent that you can get your grandkids to set by legal lines and boundaries. What are you talking about? So in that sense, there's nothing wrong to it about no, it's it. It's not wrong, it's not wrong. So, okay, let's move on. So it's not wrong, let's move on. But at the same time... But, so just negate everything he said, perhaps, or maybe just go up here and then maybe you might come back to it some other time. Who knows? Taking this national, ethnic, tribal, religious and racial identities as ultimate nature. Global Education and Skills Forum. Because yes, it's all about skills and more skills and more projects and more plans and more, more of this. See, you, you're here, you're just liking the music, but you want a house. So you have to go be in the image of me to fix the robot that promised you so much and then you see the light and then you realize it's a dead end. Wow. No. Because look, it's a dead end everywhere. Oh, oh, and then they separate and put fractals and fractals upon fractals. Wow. Nature of human being will be a serious mistake and for which we have paid an enormous price. Wow, could be a mistake. In the last few hundred or thousand years. Yes, us mystics have been paying a lot of price. What price? What price? What, what are you talking about? Too much blood has been shed, too much prejudice has happened above all. The only mystics and sages, apparently, spilled blood. Apparently, apparently they were the only ones that spilled blood. Their own blood. That's why they paid the price. Could it be that the price is recognizing that the flesh dies? Wow. You pay with the flesh that the Father gave everlasting life relentlessly showing you every day in this snapshot. Right in this snapshot of what you call your life. And it's the endurance of the flesh. But what do you see? He probably sees all the smash on the screen and he's confused where he is. We stand divided in so many different ways. You don't say. There are three fundamental aspects or activities through which we are shaping these aspects or these identities within ourselves. One is education. So he's telling, these are the mechanisms of mashhood. Economics and our spirituality. 
when really it is war against what the defilement it's a spiritual battle against your s for your soul meaning it will relentlessly defile it will relentlessly seek to destroy and devour you wow what a concept but no it says you were born so pure, and then you just forgot your inner child. You just forgot the beautiful bliss of the bliss of the blisses, and now you must see that you are loved, that you can love yourself and then love the world. Yes, because the world gave you life. The world brought you in from, from, from the genesis of light. And then your origin is apparently uh, the life which is the pang. This cloud right here and this one, that's why there's multiples and multiples of big bangs just sitting up there in your mind and pop. Wow, 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 it's all light. It's all light in my mind, my brain. There's so many light shows on the MRI scan. There's so much life in there and you can see so much things. And whoa, image upon image. And wow, we blast and flash out. And wow, wow, wow. And then you pump and pump and you feel so good because, oh, wow, you're just so thrilled and wow. Mash. All these three have become divisive processes. But all that time you think you're being still. No, you're being sucked. You're being relentlessly lied to. And your living life, meaning the life you have, is being defiled because you've believed it. You become an employee to it. Preaching equity through education. Wow, who's your employer? Who is your employer? Wow. The way we educate our children is about identifying ourselves with small identifications which leave us completely. Meaning, who giveth this person work? Is it him? You might say, oh no, it's about overcoming. You know, this and that and this and that. What are you saying? He said, oh, it's just about being still and just not having any thoughts and just battling thoughts left and right and wow, 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 and then beating the dragon and slaying the dragon here and there, wow, going to the future and past and blasting everywhere, in and out relentlessly getting up your spirit. But you call it spirit, but what spirit? You call it some cream, some serpent inside of you. And you just relentlessly powering up and you Goku power level 79 of wizard level X, that, top, top, see, very buttered mash, jump in here, murmur here, and shatter, shatter, shattered. Order out of chaos, right? What order? Your order, meaning in your image, according to what you say. Oh, I have peace. I have my peace, but your peace is, is different. And that's why you have to go in your way and find your peace. And also find your purpose. Wow, what bash. Divided as human beings, the way we are conducting our economics again divides people. Our spirituality has become super divisive process. A super divisive process. Wow, shouldn't it be the opposite? So, what is going on? What is going on? Is this person saying that the robot told him to say something? Or is he saying to the robot, what's going on? And if he's here and that's there and it's all just relative and light, 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 and light and love. Yes, you relentlessly come in and out just to show and just to enjoy what you have. Just to enjoy what you have and just try your best to do it right. Just try. Just try. Just relentlessly try and try your best. Wow. What a shame. What a shame. So how can we address these issues? <coughs> so how can we address these issues? Not how do we overcome. No, it's never about overcoming. That's why it's never about cures. Or never about actually truth. Exactly. It's anything but truth. Yes. 
anything but Christ. Christ. But this guy will say, oh, Christ, yes. We're all Christ-like. We just have to go and love and hold hands and just be. And be truthful, but just according to your truth, because truth is just so, so, so relative. What a shame. When it comes to education, it is somewhere, probably 150, 200 years ago, this mass education program started. Probably... Probably... Sometime in future, we... So he didn't say when, because really, didn't education start where? According to history, isn't it in somewhere in the desert? Some, some, where? Some city with the phones and great tablets and all this stuff. And wow, he said, oh, he said, where did they get all their knowledge? And they, he said, obviously they had a way of education. Wow. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? And who, who taught who? And where, where, where did that wisdom come from? If you come from Mash Ape, if you come from Mash Ape, how did, where is all this painting from painting, from a handprint or just a line on a wall, then to writing, to, to very, very, very encrypted schools and this and that and here and that. Wow, what is that? What are you saying? What are you saying? What is what is what is that wisdom? What is what's going on? But of course, the word of God is relentless and whether you read it in a book or anywhere in, in life, meaning what do you see? You're in God's image. So what do you see? What do you what do you what feeds you? I mean, read, read the signs, read the seasons, read the day, read the years, read the wow, Christ, yes, no, but this, no education. Well, the program of education is started some, who knows, some long ago. But and then he moves on. The future, the future, yes, plus on the future. So, of course, you probably studied under, you know, uh some other sage or guru and where did where did all that wisdom come of course you say it's millions of millions of millions of rugas and yegas and waltzes of this and that wow amazing so we did that of course to you it comes from your gods your gods yes yes they say and say and pray and pray and wow and meditate and bless and stretch and breathe and puff and puff wow oh it's all from Puff the Magic Dragon. Wow! We will look back and see that this mass education process was one of the most divisive things that human beings have done. He, wow, he couldn't wait to tell you that education, but no, education is knowledge, and knowledge is power, right? So, of course, he's saying education is the most divisive. To feed the industrialization that was happening. Oh, of, of course, just to feed the industrialization. Because no, it wasn't just to serve whatever needed to just keep you going, going into the light further and further. Well, no, it cannot be. We came up with an education package that is common for everybody, not recognizing Common to everybody, meaning we won't even leave any child behind. No child will be left back. They got their backs all right, bending them over and over to find them in the dark. What is going on? What is going on? The swarm, yes, the swarm, look. He's worshiping this woman, I look, just saying, hey, I'm not here to hurt you this morning, I'm here to take care of you, just murmur me into oblivion, yes! The individual sensibilities and the uniqueness of genius in every human being, we just came out with a mass extruder program where everybody will come out as a product. Right, because 
Every person is just so genius. Everybody is just so genius. Just so genius. You couldn't be that. Wow, everybody is here to live. Wow, to live. And then do the flesh because guess what? Of course, there's a swarm of deceivers and temptation. Any person who has ever known any suffering, then knows the suffering of the world. But no, then it's 33 degree power, Mason. Because you are the builder of your own world and you just carve and chisel and make and rearrange and put couches up here and then chair there and then it feels so open and you open up and build and build and match and match and match and more match and match even more. And it just looks so beautiful. And oh, it's just so, oh, and oh, but you can't forget about Mother Earth, so you just gotta make it all eco friendly. Make it Gaia friendly. Make it Gaia friendly. Just match and hit your head against this corner and just keep thinking you're okay because you're doing it for the children. You're doing it for the children. Right? No. What are you saying? The children are. The target of the swarm. And parents are just defiled children. What happened? What happened? But no. Adults are mature and responsible because what? They take on the sufferings of the world just to get a little piece of the pie, a little piece of the apple or the fruit of knowledge just so they can have a little bit more and more and more. And the more knowledge you have and the fruit of knowledge, the more you are rewarded in what? You guessed it. Promise, hope. False promise of, you guessed it, Rising rising like the phoenix from the ashes, meaning some afterlife in the flesh. In the flesh, as you know it, and have formed an image to be. So therefore, guess what? You believe in dust to dust. So, you defile the everlasting life in you. The relentlessness shows you what it is everywhere. What it is. But no. That will fit into the economic process or the larger economic engine that we built. When we say economy, we're talking about in a very fundamental way, we are talking about providing for the people. How is providing for the people an economy? Because it not isn't an economy, a, you know, a trade? Meaning, uh, what are you saying? An exchange. So what are you saying? Like this… In a very fundamental way, we are talking about providing for the people. Provide… we are talking about providing for the people. That's the economy, providing for the people. This is the provide what? No, the earth provided. Meaning, what? Wh what's earth? God created heaven and earth. Wow. Who knew? Earth is a purpose. The flesh is a purpose for you to see the truth and return to the Father, the way, the life. But no, you just. See Renounce it, all because, no, it's all about the ego. Some spirit in the flesh, some spirit. You're just, you're just consciousness, you're just awake. You're just awake, you're just awake and aware and in and out and in and out, just that's what, that's what life is. And you think you can blast off into the afterlife and come back and learn more and more and more and more and more knowledge and more and go reach more levels of consciousness. Yes, 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 more into the light. Yes, whoa! He wants to become the light. He wants to become the light because he believes it. He believes the love and light. Wow. And then just holding hands and sitting and just passing time to whoa, relentlessly. Wow, whoa. Who's your king? He won't tell you. Who is your ruler? Are you your own master? Do you just master, ascend, and come down whenever you want? Wow, what a shame. Providing the fundamental needs and whatever else they aspire for in an organized manner. But this has risen in such a way that today nobody talks about anything other 
Right. Because just because you can cut down some trees or take some things out of the earth or just, you know, make some little tiny things and then tell it or make things that little tiny things and then put light in it and just be like, wow, that, you know, that's economy. That's providing. No, that's defiling. That's defiling. That's defiling, man. That's not providing, man. That's defiling, man. Wow, who knew? Providing, man. The only thing that my man is ever provided for is life. Wow. The rest is just to go and live in it. Wow. The rest is just enduring. Enduring is nothing to overcome in, in the sense of becoming. You must overcome the flesh. And admit you are wrong. For no man can save himself. Therefore, no man can create anything in this life that will somehow create some other image. You're, the I you're in the image of God. Any creating any other image is suffering. Why are you doing this to yourself? Why are children being misled? Other than economics, no more discussions about weather is happening in conversations. Everybody is talking economy. It's amazing. Just about anywhere you go in the remotest part of... Exactly, because it's what you worship. Wow, who knew? You worship the currency of man, meaning just the worth, the worthlessness of man you think is amazing and you just, just, oh, you, that's all you talk about. You said it. The economy lives, oh, the economy, I'm so scared it's going to fight and leave me without a penny. Wow, 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 what am I going to do? I got to go and have a survival home in progress. All about just how to sustain your little life just a little longer, right? Not realizing who gives a damn, you will die. So why fear, when, when or how? Isn't the purpose just knowing the truth? Because then what matters when you die? What, ma what, what is going on? And you can fully judge blood life through you in the sense of accepting it. It's there. You have it. What are you doing? You're creating, trying to create a life for yourself. Wow. 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 It couldn't be that. Wow. It's the fear of being rejected by the world that keeps you from living the life through the love of the Father fully. Wow. Wow of India or in the capital cities of every nation, you will see the main subject of conversation is economics. This is not a progressive thought because we are shifting to a place where our survival process or organization of our survival process… Oh, of course, survival, he couldn't wait, he couldn't wait because it's all about survival of the fittest and blasting, you know, things that just shapeshift and turn into other things and shapeshift again until they made us. Wow. Just a bunch of shapeshifting light. Wow. Who would have thought? And of course it's oh there's bones and bones and bones and this and that and wow 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 and sit there and time and layers and all this stuff. Wow. Just a lot of just 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 a very nice story that then allows you to behave this way and everyone else to behave the way ultimately they choose. The ritual. What is the ritual of life? What is the ritual? In, wh in whose image are we in? In our image or in the image of God? Because if you're your image, then there's Others just like you and what? So how are we all seeing the same thing? How is, what is going on? If your truth is your truth and this person has to that, 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 you just be seeing your past, your past, your past. Wow. Why is it all so just so perfect? And why is it that you can just, wow, be still. Be still with the Lord. Wow. Who would have thought? Not be still with yourself and just pass thoughts away. What is going on? Wow. Has become the supreme part of our thought. 
This is not a good way to go because survival is a rudimentary aspect. Oh yes, because we've, you know, we've come so far, now it's just, yeah. What are you talking about? It's enduring of the flesh. The temptation to follow it, to find love. Or to find whatever you say, bliss or happiness or joy, all these little feelings that somehow can be just turned into fury on a dime. Wow. Wow. Could it be that? Wow. Yes. It is the Father, the God, the, God, the Creator that turns your heart towards it. And it's always there to show the flesh, what are you doing? Why do you think we have all these things? But no, it's always just, oh, I have to come to resolve some physical situation, trauma, be and it made me feel some things. And oh, 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 what are you feeling? If not the love of the Father, anything else other than that is defilement, trauma. Yes, but no, you want to go and just focus on the trauma and just being here to skyrocket, blast away, and hit thoughts left, center, and center. Wow. Homers to the abyss, for the abyss. You're serving the abyss. That's who your king is, and that's who you serve. Wow. But no, you won't say that. I know we've made it very complicated, but every worm, insect, bird, animal... Oh, he couldn't say worm. He's like, oh, but I just totally wormed you. Now I'm defiling your brain. And it's, and just, you, you, and then the worm will just make you beat the living life out of yourself relentlessly over and over again. Wow. No, it could not possibly be that. No, it couldn't. What bash? Well, he's able to take care of this with a millionth of our brain. But right. Wow. But a human beings should be looking at much something much bigger. When we say education, humans should be doing something much bigger. From ancient times, education has always been about expanding one's horizons. What are you talking? Of course, the wordsmith of wordsmith. This is the f this is the stare of a wordsmith. The, st the everlasting stare. Just Hope in the abyss whenever he could give them back because he's the best and done so much. He he knows that this is just blasted and seeing everything and just being in so so such bliss. Wow, of the light and of the light inside and wow, all this light everywhere. But today we are looking at education as how to feed the industry. So, just to feed the industry instead of expanding horizons. Whoa, what? What is expanding horizons? Doesn't that just seem some abyss? Some abyss? What are you talking about? I'm not saying we should not conduct our industry. So, education is just to send you off into the abyss. Whoa, he just couldn't wait. I'm not saying we should, have an eco we should not have an economic process, but Within fifteen, twenty years, every child has to be extruded through a machine to serve the economy or the economic engine. Serve the economy, which is industry according to him, but it's just bashwood, bashwood. He's literally a crime against humanity. <laughs> I'm very involved. It's just a little crime against humanity, just a little one. With various levels of schools, rural schools, urban schools, very elite schools of our own, and also we have a Right, just split, split, match, my relative, relative, whoa, 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 surprised that it's a mash, whoa, who would have thought? Opted over 3,600 government schools. When I see the children, which I'm sure you probably do. More than 60% of the children are just bewildered as to why are they being put through this process. Exactly, they're screaming, Mom! Dad! What are you doing? What have you sold me into? Just so you can feel so good about providing me with nothing! Defilement, the fashion and mashing and trauma upon trauma and dissolution upon dissolution, only to say what... Oh, 
What doesn't break my bones makes me stronger. Wow, I'm so stronger because I just go fast. Wow, I'm so much more. Oh, I'm so enlightened. Wow, I can just forgive myself for all the pain that the passion was because oh, I didn't know better. But now that I blast myself every time I say and get hemorrhoids, I I know what it means because somehow I saw a dream and now I know recognize my inner child and now I just can't wait to tell everyone about just stretching and stretching and huffing and puffing and yes having emotional trauma come in and out relentlessly until you can just brainwash yourself enough to just think positive always always just you can do it yes because you're worth so much you're unique you're so unique and yes the light loves you because you are light and light is love wow wow mash yes they just can't figure what is the purpose at least i could not figure till i was 25 wow 25 why the hell i have to go through education so <laughs> I so uh yeah just ditched out and said i can just you know break it in i didn't go through much education because what is the purpose Wow. Exactly. What is the purpose? Before you said it was expanding horizons, so what is it? What are you going to say? Well, somebody has a purpose for you. Somebody. What are you talking about? The purpose of life is that this life should find full expression. The purpose of life is that this life, and he points out to himself and says that it has full expression. Yes, just feed all that expression out, 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 out. What's feeding it? What is feeding it? Of course, for you, is your, is your kundalini serpent full of light that just gets to the vials and pearls and comes out and just tickles your ear and all is so good. And the world loves you for it. But no. You've have had a harsh, you've had it harsh. Well, you've had it so harsh over the years and years and years of generations. Wow, who knew? Really? Well, maybe because liars are always called out. No matter if you dress like this or dress like a flying carpet salesman. Okay, no lie. The Legion is the swarm. Multiple faces, multiple names. Yet they sing to the same song and they honor the same father, Satan. The purpose of life is not that this life should serve this or that. Every creature on the planet is. So if every creature in the palm is just to express and live, basically you're saying it's just to be, to be. And so therefore, it is the purpose. The flesh is the purpose. So you don't have to go and bash your head and against some, you know, desk, you know, in a, in a school or in a field. No. What are you talking about? You're here to know the truth, not to be deceived by some sort of knowing of yourself. Of some sort where you're like, okay, I know this and this and that and this and all around me is just based on what I'm learning and wow, it's just so real. It's just so real. It couldn't be that. Wow, it's just everything to keep me from the truth. It couldn't be, right? Wow. It's always trying to become a full-fledged life. That is the aspiration of the human being also. But now we have made that thing of longing to become full-fledged life, to find expression only in economic ways. The only way you can be something in the world is you have to be economically, you must be success in the economic field. This type of education oh, okay. will so, smother human so genius. Fulfillment is what he said. Wow, exactly. That's the false promise. Because no matter if you see, just find something that you love based on your image and just, just have it fulfill you. 
It's any, it can be anything. Just do what you love and have it fulfill you. Wow, what bash? Because it, if the promise of fulfillment is the false promise, then of course the real promise it's the life everlasting. Which matches anything of separation. Having to be long, physically a, a void second. Always searching out. Go in and turn out, in and out, and in and out, and in and out, and defilement. Nothing new or truly wonderful will happen, we are only thinking of how to use everything. Our idea of education has become this, we are teaching our children not how to be with everything, not how to be inclusive. We are only teaching our children how to exploit everything. Oh, he couldn't wait. He said, we're not teaching children how to be inclusive. When do children begin to divide? Children... You don't, you say, oh, well, we don't really know how the child thinks because it, it, the brain is still developing when you're so young. Whoa. It could not be that the child just knows. It just knows. It sees and it knows. And it, that's what it doesn't need to remember. The only reason why you have to remember things is because they were based on a false image. Trauma, trauma. So the child learns how to behave, meaning rituals. You know, it knows behavior, how to behave, so that it see it start to see things like, oh, just smash, just smash, 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 and who knew they were just become more mash. Our idea of education, unfortunately our idea of science has become like this, from an atom even to other galaxies, how to make use of them. People are... Oh, he couldn't wait, exactly. Exploring what minerals are there in Mars. Have you know, to him, he's saying as a fact, fact. You know, he's saying, well, we, we're going all there, but wha what's going on? We've not done em enough damage to one planet. Oh, exactly. Because he's separate, he's inspired by the light. He has the thunderbolt mindset level of bashhood. Before we learn how to live well on this planet, we should not step into any other planet if you ask. Oh, please, he begs. Oh, please, please, please. You know, please, let's not go somewhere else before we, you know, we're at least, you know, know what's going on here. Because it's just such a mystery, just such a mystery. It's such a whirlwind, such a spiral of ways. Wow. It's me. <laughs> Of course, everybody has to clap, otherwise they look like fools, so they're self-aware. Who knew? Who knew that the light deceiveth? Wow. Our ideas of spirituality has all become about belief systems. Wow, he couldn't wait. So exactly, if somebody says, I'm a spiritual person, that just means I have beliefs. I believe in whatever I chose. So I'm very spiritual and I guess I meditate and I'm very spiritual because I then I just bad away thoughts or they affect me, you know. And they just don't make me feel good. So I just bad and bad and bad all day and somehow I'm empowered. Yes, 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 more power, more empowerment, more, 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 give me more power, more knowledge of myself and more and more so I can just go and bash and Tell people how enlightened and wow, you should just go and pass and just love, love one another, love the love of the world. Wow, what a shame. What a shame. Different cultures have established different authorities in the form of books, in the form of divine entities, in the form of... 
Wow. Books and divine entities. Because, wow, there's so many. It's the swarm. It's the swarm. It could not be that the swarm, you know, sent it and just told and whispered and slithered and said to a man, wow, right? Right this, right that. No, it couldn't be that. Or it also couldn't be that they whispered and they saw and then they did and chased the dragon further, deeper and deeper and be started behaving a certain way by the rituals. I mean, the rituals, the behavior, but the behavior they were doing, just opening up and opening. Oh, it could not be, right? Could not be. Could not be. Form of gurus in the form of very. So exactly that the swarm. It's to you. It's not possible that the swarm has influence to write all the doctrines of man and all the wisdom of man in multiples of thousands of multiplexes of books and. He will say, think of all the books that were burned and all the lost knowledge. Some of them were just defiled, were, were, just, were just precluded. So we just have to build and build and more and more and more and just meditate and blast and blast and blast. Wow, what a shame. The only wisdom is from the Father. No man's knowledge is going to ever save man. What are you talking about? Save you from what? Because ultimately everyone just fears Death, not being able to pump and pump and dump and feel and wow, just feel your gullet and wow, feel the love of the world. Wow, shame. What a shame. What a shame. Various teachers, a time has come where we need to cultivate our children. That oh, you could not wait. Yes, just cultivate your children. Not guide them, not love them relentlessly, meaning instilling them with the truth, meaning the way of the Father. That authority cannot be the truth. Truth can be the only authority we have. Oh, okay, now we just drop. Well, truth, okay, well, it could be well, truth, okay. What are you going to say? We have to cultivate our children in this direction. So he says, we have to cultivate them and, and say, well, what truth is that? What are you saying? If we don't do this. If you don't do what? He says this. You have one authority, you respect one authority, I respect another authority. Okay. Relativism, and yes. And inevitably we will fight. Oh, of course. Wow, We yes. are fighting for economic reasons, which is for more tangible audience. fight. But we are fighting for divine geography, which is unnecessary. <laughs> divine geography, what does that even mean? Does that mean divine geography of thyself? What are you talking about? What What are you talking about? Just, if you just, just smashing, that's what he's doing, smashing and bashing. You are willing to come to this much realization, if we're willing to become Materialization, because materialism, materialism, materialism. At least straight enough in our lives that what we know, we know. What we do not know. Oh, we could just oh, not wait not to drop that. The most recycled, nonsensical, just victim to the 33rd degree power. Wow. You know, to have the power of... What we know, we know. What we do not know, we do not know. Only then education. Wow. So with that, just move on. We know we know, we don't know what we don't know. Wow. It's not that, wow. It's for man to what? Repent. Recognize the truth. Repent and abandon the ways of the world. Education will happen. True education will happen. That what we know, we know. What we know, so exactly, what we know, we know, what we don't know, we don't know. But again, then you will always just go for what you know and never admit that you are wrong. God knows all and man was created by God. Only through 
the truth, the way, the life. Is there any wisdom? Because it involves the behavior in alignment with standing in truth, meaning the way and the life, to endure the flesh. Amen. Overcome the flesh. Deny the perver the perversive ritual behavior that just go out with it and defile it more in its warm nature. It shape shifts and changes and whoa, 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 whoa. It's always just in blasting you here and there and up and down and twisting. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All the while, it is the heart that twists. And it is God's will that your heart does twist. So that it calls out and says, what are you doing? What are you doing? Not what do you want or this victim, this or whoa, 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 whoa. That's all just mash from the brain mash. Whoa. The mind mash of the, oh, just a swarm. Defiling you relentlessly, sucking the living life out of you. All with the illusion of self-empowerment and growth and progress. And wow, I'm going to go out there and change and rearrange the living room of the world. Just to make myself feel like I did something. Wow, what a shame. What a shame. There's nothing in the world to change. The, the flesh is the purpose. To show you the truth. Not some bash of this of how you can just go and smash and get some coins and just bash and invest and you know, have some more kids in your image and uh, just pass them to more and have them pass them to more. Wow, what a shame. What we do not know, we do not know. Only then education will happen, true education will happen. Because what he was trying to get at, hopefully, but no, of course not, is being humble. Abandon the ways of the world, any pride of man's way, that it's man's way that must be done. What is man's way but suffering? Yes. What is man's way but f suffering? Trying to just blast his way with knowledge and knowledge and more knowledge of the light. Wow, what a shame. What a shame. Right now, whatever we do not know, we believe. You believe one thing, somebody believes something else. Eternal clash is happening. Oh, eternal clashes because it's a spiritual battle. Wow, he just, you, he just wordsmith. But somehow he's maybe he maybe he's tormented and he has to say something, but just in a deceiving way. So what is this? A wolf in sheep's clothing. Happening. All the fight in the world, though it is being projected as good versus evil, the reality is. It is one man's belief versus another man's belief, endlessly going on, religious or otherwise. Why is it Ma, he's that saying we yes, don't it is mash and mash and more mash, but where is he going? Don't mature. Oh, but when people mature, in the next couple of decades, the entire world, why can't we do this? So how does he know people are going to mature in two decades? How does he know? How does he know that in two decades people were will mature? What is he talking about? That we come to this much understanding, what we know, we know, what we do not know, we do not know. This is not happening because we have not educated our So people haven't been completely bashed yet and he's about to tell you why. Our children and adults that I do not know is a tremendous possibility. Yes, it's just infinite of possibility upon possibility whoa 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 just obvious it's i mean life is relentless it it is perpetuated earth is perpetuated by why the love of the father who created it wow no couldn't be couldn't be it just has to be some magical just perpetuity of abysses and so much so distant and wow we're so tiny it's just infinite Infinite, 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 infinite ways to be and split my personality so many. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What a shame. And even if you're, yes, 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 it's about 
having control and dominion over, you know, all those personalities so then you can become more real, more present, more aware, more conscious of light. Yes, and love. Wow, what a shame. Only if you see I do not know, the longing to know, the seeking to know, and the possibility of knowing becomes a living reality. The seeking of knowing becomes a living reality. Wow, what is he saying? Seek and then you will live seeking. What whatever you don't know, you believe. If you believe whatever you do not know... See, it's just... It's smashing, smashing, flipping you in. And there's people that are actually saying, yes, I'm following you. Yes, yes, I did it. I followed him all the way to the end. Yes, yes. Fast, fast. Just now the world is, wow, it's perfectly in place. You will become confident without clarity. With Con our clarity. You will become confident with our clarity. Whose clarity? What are you saying? Confidence without clarity is a disastrous process. Wow, isn't that what you're saying? Because any man's way is a dead end. Wow, it's only the way of the Father that Christ saw it. Wow, it couldn't be. No, Jesus was just some guy that Jesus was mad by the Romans, but he could have been real, but real in church is all he is, but... This is just another guy like me. Wow. What are you saying? Where there is no clarity, it is better there is hesitation. If clarity comes, let's do everything. If oh, if clarity comes, let's do it. Okay, so we just gotta wait till it happens, right? Because you couldn't possibly just do it right now and admit you're wrong about everything in your life that you come that you come to identify and uh, find value in that's just bashing it's bashing you relentlessly wow but you can't seem to you're always twisting and anguishing oh what's what's wrong i just have to get a life coach and find a way and study and find all these books and wow 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 yes yes and talk about wow wow it's if just, there is it's no it's all about opening your mind and just letting people do what they want and just firing children to blast and blast and blast and blast some more and just feel 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 just feel and feel and then be devastated but don't worry just feel some more just feel some more and heal you can heal because you are you are light and love and yes Yes, the world does love you, and, and of course, yes, yes. No, bash. Clarity, we should at least hesitate. If you have confidence without clarity, it becomes disastrous. If you have confidence without clarity, which is what you're doing, then what? This is what belief systems are giving people. People believe something. Suddenly they're confident. It doesn't matter how much disaster it causes to themselves or to Wow, okay, he's doing a bomb here. He's just blasting. The people, by this point, they, what, they don't even know what he's saying because it doesn't even matter now. So, so, he's been saying just bash, 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 but this, wow. Yes, believing in something other than seeing the truth and believing, believing, believing. Meaning, the absence of disbelief. Meaning, you don't, there was no split, there was no ever, recognizing that it's not about believing you are here to create your life and feeling, and being separate from God. Because it's truly a, just a backwards, inverted, upside down way of just saying, you, 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 you believe yourself separate from God from the life everlasting and the love. Wow. To everybody around them, but it will go on because we believe. What we believe is a psychological reality. Oh, so reality is just psychological, okay. It may not have anything to do with the existential realities where we exist. Because, oh, now it's existential. Or maybe he's just wordsmithing. Maybe he's saying reality is what you see, and existential is what you actually live. What are you saying? He's just flipping you like a pancake here, just twisting you over it. Oh, the spiral, but oh, look, it's so beautiful. Just education 
is a way of expanding our perceptions. Oh, he could not wait. Education is a mean by expansion or bashing so that we can just learn the skills and tools to just be numb to the bashing. Yes. Of how existence is, whether it is science or spirituality or whatever. See, because he doesn't give a damn. He's like, or spirituality or whatever, right? No. That's all it is. It's a spiritual battle for your soul. The lifeline to the Father. Wow. Who would have thought? What a concept. Wow. No, it couldn't be, right? No. It has to be a, about, you know, divinities and all these nice people and just going around in the sky with ships and getting their journey. Wow, 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 wow. Mash. Essentially, we are trying to know, we are trying to understand, we are trying to grasp something more than what we know right now. Oh, we're trying to grasp. He just, what he just said was, you're tracing the dragon. You, it's the same thing. You're, you've been hooked and baited by false promise. That's what he said. But, no, it just sounds so nice. Because, yeah, we're all just so frustrated, but we're always just trying to do the best. And we're all just going forward, but nowhere. And just we're past and present, and shape shifting in and out because we're light touch with light beings and quantum physics and all this. Wow, wow, with the wormholes and the black holes and the black matter and the white magic. And wow, wow, wow. And all this stuff. And wow. Bash. Bashhood. More levels of bashhood than you could even stack. Wow. Whoa. And from our exploration of this creation, we know if we spend another ten million years here, we will still continue to learn. Oh, what a shame. What a shame. If you, if a million years go by, you know, a million Harry Potter, fictitious, mansion, chime in, you know, time, whatever, but if some... If generations go by and you still are learning, what are you learning then? Because it's all about standing with the truth relentlessly because you're, that's, you see it. How can you just not? When you see the truth, you cannot turn away. And you certainly cannot have a foot in the truth and a foot in the world. Because guess what? Cannot serve two masters. When this is the nature of our perception and this is the nature of the existence in which we live, there should be no room for belief. There should be no... Oh, he just wants you to be just a... just a mash of joy relentlessly always there's no room for talking or even thinking because you're relentlessly bashing them left and right yes you just bounce off into the abyss and sit and be be still and watch the river of thought just go and then focus here and there and just prioritize the what is that going then you're hitting home runs everywhere mash and the crowd goes wild loving you back because you love the world so much wow now you do it more and more and more and it just Shows you so many things. Could it be that the light, that, that the light, deceive it? Hmm. No room, room for dogma. Education should become a process where. Process education. No. The wisdom of the father. It's for the father to know. and show us the truth. We must abandon our pride and our ways, which en inevitably are the ways of the world, because that's what we do ritualistically, meaning that it's a behavior. It's the ways of the world, but you must overcome the flesh. 
see the spirit. The spirit. The Holy Spirit. Not some spirit that can be this spirit to you and that spirit to him and this and so many spirits. So many spirits and you just cause all the spirits in and get wasted. Wow. Exactly. Polluted, wasted, defiled, obliterated, just relentlessly. Whether it's through the obvious reference of alcohol right now or another sense of influence that just passes and just puts you in a stupor and a murmur of the world. Because, yes, you can just go out and make friends and just just have the circle jerk you into oblivion. But, oh, they're there for me in hard times. Wow. Did they ever point you to the truth, the way, and the life? Wow. Then, what are they then? What are they? Seeking is encouraged. Exactly. Where every Seeking. human being becomes a seeker. Their seeker is just defiling, trying to seek whatever. They don't care, they're just seeking. The fundamental qualification of seeking is that you have realized that what you know is very little. What wow. you do not know. What you know is very little. Hmm. What is it that you're here to know? If not to live the life everlasting, forever and ever. Hallelujah. Amen. And to see yourself in your fall. And that the light will show it you. But then you create the image of what you want to see yourself as in the image of God. But then the light is then telling you, oh, see yourself like this and like that and this and the other. Wow, what bash. No, is limitless. In the yogic culture, there is a tradition that we always identify with our ignorance, not our knowledge. Wow, we always identify with our image and not our knowledge. Couldn't wait. That we always identify with our ignorance. Oh, ignorance, which is image. Exactly. Your ignorance is believing your image. Wow. Not our knowledge. Not our knowledge. And what is the knowledge if just not what you think you're receiving the fulfill the so called fulfillment from the way you behave in life. Because <coughs> what I know and what you know are two boundaries. Right, because you're separate. Everyone's separate, yet we believe in just one consciousness and this and holding hands, right? Wow. Knowledge creates a boundary. No, so it's knowledge that creates boundaries, but then we have to smash it so that we can just love each other and see each other finally. Wow, what are you saying? Our ignorance is boundless. <laughs> this form is boundless. Because, yes, your image, in your image you will relentlessly be seeking how to better position yourself in the world, of course. Because bash, 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 more bash, and you were told bash, and this bash, and... You experience bad, and now we're bad, bad, bad. Wow. Bashwood. If you identify with your ignorance, all of us will be together. If we identify with our knowledge, you will be on one island. I oh, he couldn't wait. So now he's saying we just have to all be on the same side. Wow. Yeah, we just have to all just go to the one side of the room. And then everything will be okay. Wow, what a shame. I will be on another island, and these two islands may never... It cannot possibly be that, yes, there are people who choose this, the flesh over life everlasting. Yes. Wow, what a concept. And that they're fulfilling the will of their father, Satan. Wow, no, that could not be. Wow, yes. But of course this person is saying, no, no, no. Never meet. Knowledge or what we know right now, what we have perceived, what we have understood is valuable, but it is very puny. Co puny compared to the one second that we've spit in this liver of, you know, the whole time of the world and the big bang, and bang, 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 just so little. Exactly, because you believe in dust and so 
dot to dot. Compared to the nature of creation. Compared to the nature of creation. Because nature came from creation and creation just created nature. I mean, it's so simple, right? What is creation? Of course, he won't say. Because apparently creation is just, you just go be whatever you want, what, as long as you just respect and tolerate and we can all just live and hold hands together under the swarm. Wow, what a shame. It could not be that, yes, the only thing to that divides is the truth. Those who will stand aligned with it or reject it. Wow, what a concept. So instead of you saying, yeah, just come over here, over here. No, yes, you must pick a side with both feet and say yes. Because if you straddle the line, it is your demise. It is exactly in alignment. If you just balance, you balance, you balance. Be, be the dark and the light. What are you talking about? And it's not even being the light. No, what are you talking about? It's the X. Wrong. Both things. There's oh, one way to it. Well, no, there's one way. Yes. Repent, return to the Father. Admit you are wrong. Forgive. Forgive. And overcome the flesh. Return to the Father. Love your enemy. Humble yourself. It is the Father's will. And it is the choice of man's behavior. Guided by truth. That of course is the protection and for the endurance of the flesh. In this snapshot of life everlasting. Do not fear death. Fear not knowing your father. In the living. Amen. Hallelujah.